Okay guys, so it's settled down a little bit here on the lake and I'm actually gonna be filming a little video right here. So today we're going to be talking about what I carry uh, for food or what kind of meal sets I use when I go out, when I bushcraft, when I'm hunting, when I'm hiking, and whenever I do any of my outdoor adventures, uh, the types of meals I eat and what I bring into the field, aside from what you can just harvest alone in the field. So without any further ado guys, please do not forget to comment, like, share, and subscribe to see more awesome Alaskan content like this. And now let's jump into it. Okay guys, so I'm gonna have to speed through this a little bit fast because I forgot to charge the battery on this camera. So that sucks a little bit. But today we're going to be going into what I carry for uh, food, what I have for prepared for food. So I'm gonna pop a few things out of here. This is stuff from a trip that I went on and I'm gonna throw it here real fast. So, you know, real life backpack stuff. So anyways, let's jump into what I carry for food. So starting off with it, I've always been a really huge fan ever since I got into Cliff Bars. I've always been a really huge fan of Cliff Bars. So one of my first foods that's in here uh, is just an assortment of different Cliff Bars. So this is a white chocolate macadamia. Uh, another one I like a lot when I have water, this is a big thing, when I have water, I like these chocolate brownies because not only are they tasty, but they are one of those things that like chocolate, it makes you really thirsty. So <clears throat> I like those because they can help make sure that I'm getting enough water into my body. And at the same time, they taste really good. Now, if I'm not after that, generally I won't eat those ones, but those are kind of my favorite for that. So I kind of have this area partially lined with uh, Cliff Bars because I find them really nutritious and what I, I think my favorite thing about Cliff Bars is not only are they really tasty, but they're also kind of power packed with quite a bit of calories. So you're getting a good sustaining meal that's also really tasty and it's ready to go. You just pull this out of its package, rip it open, and voila, you have tasty. So the next thing I carry is a whole bunch of different uh, kind of drink mixes. Now these are just some <clears throat> standard, and what I like is, I know these say stress relief or like stress less kind of teas, but the reason why I get these is I want some non-caffeinated teas, and on the back, or like some of these are caffeinated teas. So I have my choices because sometimes you don't always want a caffeinated drink. You sometimes want a decaffeinated drink. So it's nice to have those uh, decaf and caffeinated drinks. So another thing I do have in here, I can't find at this particular moment, is um, I also have some hot chocolate mixes in here as well as I have some different um, coffee mixes. So I have some different coffee mixes and also the tea mixes that I went over. So then down here I have, and I'm gonna release this buckle so it's not as hard to get this stuff out. But then down here is what I have for my trail mix. And this is kind of my own concoction. Uh, one of these days I'm gonna go over my trail mix with you guys. But this is what I kind of have and basically the basics to it are is I take a lot of my favorite cereals plus some graham crackers and um, some dried berries and I basically put it all in here and then sometimes with this one um, I think there are some in here but generally I also like to put a little bit of chocolate in there too because once again I like chocolate for two reasons one it tastes it's tasty but two it also kind of uh, causes you to want to drink water so uh, it helps you keep a little bit more hydrated and uh, I like that about it so anyways I'm gonna actually do if you guys want it's by request but if you guys want to see that I will do a video of my <clears throat> trail mix and what I carry for the trail but anyways guys that's basically all I have to say on my trail mixes and foods that I carry to eat like I said if you guys do want to see a video on my trail mix and how I whip it together let me know in the comment section below I think I can make it a little bit fun but I wanted to go over this. These are the foods that I carry personally out in the field and what I like to eat when I'm out here. And so anyways, guys, that's all for now. God bless, and I'm out.